For bike riders, the Alps is one of the most exciting regions to visit. And today, on the best of Tesla Tour, we feature some of its most talented and dedicated food artisans. Each year, I've enjoyed visiting the Alps. In 2015, I stopped by Ferme Rochai, where they make excellent Alpine small goods. Karine Gano and assistant Melissa make a variety of pork sausages, like the locally famous Murson, that home cooks poach in a broth and serve with potatoes. They prepare a beautiful selection of porterines flavored with herbs, pistachio and hazelnuts, and expertly cure a tasty range of salami and dry small goods. It is so pleasing to know that the great tradition of making Alpine charcuterie is not lost. And it is so delicious. This Alpine loaf packed with local cheese, ham and walnuts is a good choice for a party. I first place some self-raising flour in a bowl with some eggs and lemon olive oil and mix well before adding a little milk and cream. Next, I add some black pepper, some pitted black and green olives, some cubes of Beaufort and Gruyere cheese, some walnuts, and mix the preparation well. I then spoon one third of the preparation into a well battered and floured loaf tin. Next, I carefully top with some ham sticks. I then top with more mixture before adding some more ham. Lastly, I finish with the remaining mixture. Gently flatten the top and decorate with heart-shaped cheese slices. I bake the loaf in the preheated oven at 170 degrees for about 40 minutes. Once the loaf is cooked, I wait at least half an hour before slicing it. A green salad is the perfect accompaniment to this delicious cake au fromage et jambon des Alpes. La Maison Carrier has a fabulous farmhouse decor and serves very good Savoy cuisine. Pierre Carrier is a fourth generation restaurateur in Chamonix. Moi, j'ai souhaité continuer à, à faire cette cuisine parce que c'est une cuisine que j'avais appris avec mon père et que j'aimais beaucoup. Une cuisine traditionnelle de pays. At the center of the restaurant, the wood-fired rotisserie sets the mood. The first order of the day is a rack of lamb that will roast slowly for 20 minutes. Above the rotisserie, the giant farmer's chimney is still in use for drying a selected range of small goods. A thinly sliced selection is given to guests as a welcome nibble. I have ordered a house-made black pudding served with a bacon, pear and potato concoction. It's memorable. Cheese, especially during the winter months in the mountains, is an important part of peasant food. The selection on the restaurant platter is exclusively alpine. Sitting on several levels of a turning old wooden farm tool, these appetizing sweets are amongst the best examples of French family desserts that I have seen on many Tesla tours. I almost tasted them all for you. In our next Best of Tesla Tour, we feature more amazing Alpine specialties. Hi.